hello there all you wonderful people of the internet. This is the start of a fun little series or mini series of house hunting for us. No one else, but for us. What yes. have we decided, Ryan? We've decided we need to downsize and get more land. So yes. like square footage wise in our house, we're gonna downsize. Or at least home. have it all in one level. One or the other. Like this house yeah. is technically the same. Oh, is it? Well, it's so the house we're going to look at right now is like eight just over eighteen hundred square feet. Three hundred of that though is in a basement. It has a basement, which is very odd for um, North Carolina houses. That's very rare. Um, but it's a walkout basement, so that's why. If you see a basement, it typically will be like a walkout basement. Um, so it's about like fifteen hundred square feet on the upper floor, where but it's all one level. My main issue is stairs. Stairs are very hard for me, um, and so Ryan gets sent up the stairs a lot. So he'd probably also appreciate if he didn't have to always run up the stairs. <laughs> um, so yeah, the house we're going to look at now is on just a wonderful garden in back. Like it, it looks so nice. So we just decided we down we want to downsize our mortgage so we can save more money so that in a couple years we can buy a bigger piece of land with our families. Yeah. Um, so it's just like it makes sense and we want more land. We have four dogs now. They don't have a lot of room to run around. Um, it hasn't been an issue, but like they would love to have like more of a yard to you know yeah. run and frolic and stuff in, and so we'd like to be able to do that for them too. And once you get more out into the country, you can get more for less, um, not necessarily like, more of a house. Daisy can um, for mice. But that's not really a concern. For so us. Daisy can find mice, yeah. Basically, I want at least 1,100 square feet. Like that's that's what I prefer the minimum be. Who's ready to look at houses today? So we've got at least six on the itinerary. Are you ready? Nope. <laughs> so we've arrived at this first house and there's already people here already checking it out so this one is a bit far it's I believe it's another showing she said there's a lot of interest in it yeah so this house in particular is on you said about three acres three to four acres, three to four acres. it's pretty far from where we are currently it's about a half hour um, and it's more than we want to spend. <laughs> it's not, but, it's, out of, it's not unaffordable. Right. It's, just, no, no. it's still less than our current mortgage. Right, it's still less than our current house, price-wise, but right. it's still like, more than I want to spend. Let's go 50000 less, and I'm like, let's go 30000 less. <laughs> I'm like, there. Just put it in perspective. I found one that's not, not about a third. Yeah, and that, look at the worth... house you were trying to get me to get. So only two bedrooms, only an acre, only a 900 square foot house. Um, 990, okay? That's practically a thousand. Oh yeah, yeah, that's all that. So walk in the front door. Living room. And they did. Smart home, everything. Whoa. Ryan has vetoed it. In one mile, turn left onto US Highway 301 South because it's oh, too oh, far away. No. Oh, that's like one that caught on fire. Oh. But the one we're going to look at next, it's a bit of a hot mess. Um, it needs like a total renovation, which could be fun, but it needs a total renovation. Uh, no. Why do you get back here, Ryan? <laughs> this is this is interesting. Yeah, oh, it was showed pink. Oh, yeah. but... oh, look, honey, perfect for you. If you need help in the bathroom, <laughs> there you go. Oh, I think you can get a 203 on this. I really do. Oh, you could open this all up. Yeah, you could. Where's the best? should be able to open this up. Wow. It's humongous. The problem we're having is there's not like a lot of room. It's very, very woodsy. There's not a ton of room for gardening. But Ryan found this area. A maze. Yeah, it does look like a maze. They're having fun.
this property is unique, but I actually like it. Kind of reminds me of my grandparents' house uh, that they used to have. They had 25 acres. A lot of it was wooded. Actually, like half of it was wooded, half of it wasn't. And it was just like we could run around down in the valley where it was wooded. So many good memories there. And this kind of gives me that feel again. Like, has that similar type of vibe. So we found this pear tree that's on the property. All the pear trees have already fell and died. But there's persimmons, two persimmons trees, and uh, who knows what else. We are now at house number three, and this one is interesting. So you walk in, we've got this nice laminate right here, which leads into this nice wood, which leads into the nice carpet over here, and into this nice, other laminate? Oh, is this? Oh. Um, different floor over there. Why? This is. Oh, well, this is at least the same as what's at the front door. It's a while later, and we are now on to house number four. Oh, there's an upstairs. Okay. Well, this is. Cute little house. Real nice. Floors look nice. This looks like LVP, right? Yeah. Got fireplace. Ooh, look at that. Cute little kitchen. Could do the building table there. Fridge right there. Brand new uh, oven. All brand new appliances. This is, uh, strange. Uh, 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 this is a right? uh, That's funny, because I was just about to say, this is really like a cute little house. And then I opened this and saw that this is the laundry closet. In our second apartment, the laundry closet was right off the kitchen. Sure. Yep, this is the master. Everything's new, they redone everything. Yeah, nice master bathroom. Yeah. Just kind of strange with the window right there. Yeah. Straight out to the Definitely front the, porch. All the stuff that I, oh, see it's on the other outside though. We could do the stuff I bought um, for the front doors. Oh, yeah. There's, oh, I finished the oh. utility. Toilet, bathtub. Little. Oh, a little, like linen closet. Both of them have the things that Yeah. Have. I mean, they're essentially, oh. I was gonna say they're identical, but not quite. Definitely downsized. <laughs> it is definitely small, yes. Um, no doubt about that. It's the first house I've looked at that like, I like though. It's a real nice house. It's definitely small. You said, what did you say the square footage on this is? I can't get into it right now. <laughs> um, wait, wait, I don't it, it is nice that the master is on the first floor and the kids are yeah. upstairs. That tree line? Oh dang, then comes all the way down here. And assuming probably even back there a bit. What'd you think of that one? It's the first house I really look like, except that there is no workshop, there's no garage. There's no it's office. It's already a small house, which like is fine, but there's no, yeah, there's no office, there's no, no garage. Extra there's not space even a driveway. Yeah. Like there's not. What was the price on this? I know it was under 200. I wonder what the acreage on this is. Like one, maybe 1.25. Why, why did we have to look at this house? Think about the garden, think about the, the space for the dogs to run and play and the kids and just all of the fun that could be had outside. I'm sorry, oh. I brought you to the nice new house. <laughs> 